Hi folks, I'm here at Stylo event, the Stylo Gala night, and I'm here with one of the most amazing fashion designer, Marco and his whole team, okay, and they design and style for Lady Gaga, okay, but let us get into a bit more of what Marco and who's Marco and his entire team is all about. Marco, it's a pleasure to have you here in Malaysia. Yeah, thank you. Pleasure to meet you. Oh, we were really lovely in Malaysia. Yeah, really love it. So Marco's here with the hairstylist and her make his makeup artist. Okay, you've been in the industry for a long time. Now you've showcased in like two years. Yeah, two years. Two years is pretty much there to survive. Okay, yeah, and you. But I survived with one collection, so what is good? Tell us a bit about what inspires you in fashion. What gives you that motivation to get up and give your best? Well, it always depends of, of, of inspiration at the moment. My inspiration for this collection was Renaissance costume and the character of Lady Macbeth from Shakespeare's play. So it all depends on the moment. I was, as I said, inspired with Renaissance, with elements of Renaissance costumes, and I played with, with uh, colors and uh, pleated echo leather. And the uh, hairdresser did the anthers for the show. Makeup artist did very special uh, makeup for, for my collection, so it ended up looking like this. And what kind of person Lady Gaga is? What kind of, sorry? A person Lady Gaga is. What kind of person is she? Well, uh, Nicola Formacetti, uh, her style is, he's working a lot with, with young designers in London, so he chose me as one of the designers to take clothes from to do editorial with her for Q Magazine and few of the videos for her Monster Ball tour. So that's how Lady Gaga fit. Yeah, that's how it all started. No, I didn't make I didn't make uh, uh, outfits for her. He chose stuff that I have already in my collection. So he used pieces from my collection. I have few shows, few uh, countries to to visit with presenting of my collection to present my collection where. And also, I will do my next collection in September for London Fashion Week. That is like most important things to do. How how do you She's feel? The most amazing model that I ever met. So what? that's why that's why I decided to choose her as my uh, face of my campaign that I did for London. What do you find special about her? Everything, everything. Her appearance, her posturing, everything. She's really, really good. Tell us a bit about your, you know, the outfit that she's wearing. That's the outfit that Lady Gaga wore. That's that's top. And these gloves are also <laughs> gloves that she wore on the cover of Q magazine. Well, it's made of, it's a combination of echo leather and satin with, uh, how, how do you call, um, yeah, like, okay, like cage, cage coated with beads. And there's a metal construction under going on, yeah. And of course, color is included because it's the, the basic inspiration of my collection was Renaissance costumes, so I have a lot of colors in there. So tell us what you think of a Marco. Oh, I think he's amazing, really. Because um, I met him on the shoot, like he was explaining, and my when because I was studying law at that time, but my agency said, you know what, you have to do this shoot. He's the next Alexander McQueen. He's amazing, and I had an exam, exam the next day, really, but I still went into it, and I told him on the spot, like, I'm so lucky that I actually decided to do it because they were amazing, and the photographer was amazing. The photos are breathtaking and. I get lucky, really lucky. Folks, you've got a fellow Malaysian here giving a testimony that Marco could be the next Alexander McQueen. So, you know, but seriously, all the best to you and your team. I think it's always good to have an entire team effort and, um, and uh, really wish you all the best from Malaysia, from Stylo and from the star. Thank you so much. Do you have anything to say to all the Malaysians here, to the Malaysian fashion scene? Well, I haven't saw the Malaysian fashion scene yet, but according to uh, style of stuff that they did before, I find it very, very interesting. So I'm very looking forward to see. We're looking forward to showcase ours, and we're looking forward to see your fashion here too. Thank you. Yeah? How you come? I love Malaysia. I don't have anything to say to the fashion scene just yet because I'm really waiting to be impressed. But I love the people, the hospitality, the food even the weather we were warned that it was going to be insanely humid i so don't mind even my hair goes crazy well need a minute now it's obviously but i love it uh place we're staying is fraser's place they go above and beyond the call of duty to make us feel comfortable and welcome so i'm very grateful i love malaysia i'm moving people get ready <laughs> get ready um, I think that people should experiment, please experiment, don't be afraid, you know, play with cans, 
Put the raffles on, just shine out there and, and yeah, we love you.